I really think that one of the big misnomers of computer science, and something I read online was, was people saying, well, I don't want to do computer science. I want to do something that helps people. And that kills me. It physically hurts me when people say that because everyone should be able to learn how to design web pages, but everyone should also be able to access those web pages. It's kind of this idea of there's technology you're using every day. How is it working? Nowadays, if your site isn't what we call responsive, which means when you look at it on an iPhone versus a tablet versus a laptop, you want to have a really good experience on, on either. So I've tried to break it down so that the course is really for beginners. And so there's a lot of small skills students can pick up in the first couple weeks of the course. But one of the things I really stress in this class, which may be different from any of the other programming courses, is this idea of accessibility. I've been to places, I've been to demos, where they've had these really cool robots. And they say, all right, our robot will follow any voice command you want. And what they hadn't considered is that it was trained by a big group of 26-year-old males. And as soon as a 40-year-old woman voices a command, it doesn't work. So I really think that the more people we can get in and the more people we can get interested in technology, it's going to open up all these avenues. And I think, again, we're not going to have that unless people feel comfortable enough with technology to realize that their voice deserves to be heard.